my feet out for my chickens this morning. Today is a little different than, it's Friday, so it's a little different than it usually is. Dad is home, yay. We are still having schoolwork to do and get that done. We may do a little less and kind of try to push it off to the next week. But I'm thinking maybe we're going to take off next week because Dad will be off another four days. I say Dad, it's my husband. Just sliding. Sorry about that, guys. But we're gonna be we're gonna be doing some schooling today, getting that done for the rest of the week, and then I'm gonna be making plans for the the next week. Get my boots on because all I have is my flip flops or sandals, whatever these things are called. But. About to go feed my chickens, feed the ducks. I did get a little bit more extra feed since they're in the pen. Maybe they'll eat a little bit more. I don't know. But today is going to be a little bit different than it usually is. My husband's home. And we usually don't do school when he's home. But we have one day left of this week. And I believe we may take off next week. Because my husband's supposed to be off another... Uh, another... How many days? Four days next week. So that's always great. But we still have to get school done this morning. My kids are not <laughs> in the group for it right now. This mama is trying to get things done. And then we're going to work on getting everybody focused on what they're supposed to be doing today. And here we go to the chicken coop. No, we're not going out yet. Everybody seems to be doing good this morning. Got a bunch of happy chickens. Happy chickens. Alright, we'll see y'all here in a little bit. Oh. oh, it's quite chilly out here this morning. Oh. I'm trying to get all my stuff back up. I got these chickens fed. putting my boots on and I'm gonna go back out here to the chickens and see if there's any more eggs I only got like six or seven this morning which I came out here a little bit earlier and uh, I had the ducks out there I don't know if that had anything to do with it but Maggie's coming with me Bye. <laughs> we're gonna go see what we can find out here and check on our baby chicks it's I think it's about I want to say 20 degrees, maybe tw between 15 and 20 degrees out here. It's so cold. Yeah, and it's so going. cold. All right. Here we go around the pond. Oh, okay, we are up here at the chicken coop. I got a few chickens out here. It's a cold out. day today. <laughs> Hello, girls. Okay. We're going to go. Oh, my goodness. It's so cold. We're going to get inside of this house where it's a little warmer. <clears throat> Come on, Max. Okay. It's a lot warmer in here. we got a whole bunch of eggs now, Max. Oh my goodness, you baby chickens look like babies no more. I know, they're not looking like baby chickens no more, are they? They like to peck at my boots. So Maggie, what do you think about the baby chickens? They're not babies no more. They're not babies no more, are they? Here they are, guys. It seems like they're doing pretty good with this, um, it's really cold, but they got that light in there. They look a little, these bigger ones, they look a little bit puffed up. They're kind of just keeping each other warm, I guess, back there. Under that light, they seem to be doing good. The water's not frozen, so it's got to be above 32 degrees in here. I'm not, I need to bring a thermometer, 
not the mama bear. <laughs> Whatever it's called. Out here and just see what, what the temperature is in here. I have one in the house that I may run up here here shortly and just see see what we got. Good morning. Hi, David. Y'all got feet in that thing still. You're picking at my feet. Yeah, you're picking at my feet. There ain't nothing on them but snow. Maybe that's what they're getting. The snow off my... This morning, my boys were having a little bit of a hard time getting focused and motivated on getting their schoolwork done. I did have to coast them into saying, hey, we get to play with our toys and daddy's home and we'll get to play with dad and do different things if we can get the schoolwork done first. So that really motivated them to get them to get what, what they needed to get done. I am planning out on pulling the treasure chest out. <laughs> I have a treasure chest that has many different um, toys and um, pins and stickers and what else was in there, Maggie? There's Play-Doh, toy, toy cars. It's got little toys in it that I say, hey, and I only pull it out whenever we're going to be doing some major cleaning. The house is a little bit of a wreck right now, so I'm going to pull out the treasure chest soon and say, hey, we're going to get this school, or school work. We're going to get this house cleaned, and whenever we get the house cleaned, we're going get to a, get a prize out of the treasure chest, and it usually works every time. So that excites them and that helps them get motivated. We're going to pick up our toys. We're going to pick up any paper or trash or anything like that. We're going to sweep, mop, and all that good stuff. So those are that's a way that I help motivate them. We do have a little bit of a busy day because we're trying to get ready for the Sabbath. And so that we can have our day of rest with the Lord, we got to get that done before sunfall. But we're going to get it done. We're out here with the chickens for a few minutes. Me and Maggie are. We're just hanging out. Where you at, Maggie? There she is. The chickens are trying to eat me. We're just hanging out for a few minutes out here. She's still got some schoolwork she needs to get done. And we're doing it. <laughs> so me and Maggie are going back up to the house here in just a second. I think we're going to walk around the pond. I put Hoyt and Mary in the pen last night. And she did lay an egg this morning. And I was getting them and giving them to my cousin because she feeds them to her dogs. And... I have not yet found a nest. So she's got to be laying them somewhere. She makes a nest in the, the chicken's house. So there's got to be a nest out here where the eggs are, but I just haven't found it yet. And what I may end up doing is, since it is starting to get pretty chilly here in Kentucky, I may go ahead and put them in the pen each night if I can get them to go. They usually do pretty good. They, they were living in there until the chicken ended up dead. And I don't know if um, my duck did it or what happened with that one. All the other ones seem to be doing good. But I do plan on maybe trying to just put them in there. And maybe I can get her eggs in the morning, let them out whenever I go to feed and water. And then whenever I go to feed and water in the evenings, um, put them back in. Thank you for watching. I hope you liked my vlog. If you did, hit that like and subscribe button. And I'll see you later. God bless you all.